Here we have a very crystal clear glass with very clear hot water in it because it's being filtered before it was heated. I'm going to just gently pop a tea bag in. What you can see there is the brewing act taking place. This is a good breakfast strength tea. So it's gonna have quite a lot of Assam and other quick brew teas. It's a blended tea. It's called Everyday Tea by Twinings, for those that are interested. As you can see already, quite a lot of the strength of the tea is already lowered to the very bottom. Now I've not stirred the water and it was totally still when I started the camera. I'm going to give it a little stir in a minute, but I can still see some really interesting dynamics going on here with the tea colouring taking place as the reaction takes place. I'll give it a very gentle stir now, just a waft. A lovely golden brown colour going on there. It's been about a minute and 50 seconds where the tea bag's been in. And as we come up to the two minutes, for me that's now brewed. So gentle squeeze. And I would be adding milk and sugar to that to taste, but that to me is a perfect cup of tea and one key point to note is that milk and the tea leaf whether it be tea leaf or tea in a bag like this is shouldn't meet so it doesn't it really doesn't matter which you put in first the tea or the milk if you're using a teapot because as long as the milk and tea leaf never meet each other doesn't matter and of course if you're using a teapot then the uh, tea strainer or the tea bags will remain in the teapot and won't meet the milk in the cup or glass and um, if you're using a tea bag, then absolutely remove the tea bag from the mug before you then add the milk, and uh, you've got yourself uh, a wonderful cup of tea. And if you do let the milk and the tea bag touch, you get a rather distasteful chemical reaction that can make the tea taste quite bitter, almost sour. So there's a quick little tip for you: if you are leaving the tea bag in and removing it after the milk's gone in, try it. Uh, try taking out the tea bag before and you might find your teas uh, at least twice as good.